The birthday of the Blessed Virgin Mary, the mother of Jesus, is celebrated on September 8th. Her parents are traditionally thought to be Saint Anne and Saint Joachim. This tradition rests on Proto-Evangelium of James, an apocryphal gospel, which dates from the end of the second century. The birth of Mary was obtained by the fervent prayers of Joachim and Anne, in their advanced age. As Joachim belonged to the royal family of David, so Anna is supposed to have been a descendant of the priestly family of Aaron, thus Christ the eternal king and priest sprang from both a royal and priestly family. According to the Gospel of Luke chapter 1, Mary lived in Nazareth, a city in Galilee, at the time of the Annunciation. A certain tradition maintains that she was conceived and born in the same house in which Jesus became incarnate. Another tradition, based on the Gospel of James, regards Sephoris as the earliest home of Joachim and Anne, though they are said to have lived later on in Jerusalem, Probatica. It was here that Mary was born. It is said that, as early as in the 5th century the Empress Eudoxia built a church over the place where Mary was born, and where her parents lived in their old age. Another crypt near Stana's tomb is the supposed birthplace of the Blessed Virgin, hence it is that in early times the church was called Mary of the Nativity, the Feast of Our Lady's Nativity, was not celebrated in Rome till toward the end of the 7th century. According to the book of Exodus chapter 13, all the Hebrew firstborn male children had to be presented in the temple. Tradition holds that Joachim and Anne presented Mary in the temple since they had obtained her by their long, fervent prayers. Now, the Proto-Evangelium of James, and the writing entitled De Nativitate Mariae, state that Joachim and Anne, faithful to a vow they had made, presented the child Mary in the temple when she was three years old. It is said that the child herself mounted the temple steps, and that she made her vow of virginity on this occasion. The church also celebrates the feast of the presentation. Please subscribe to Catholic News World's YouTube channel. Thanks and God bless.